Hello there everyone, this is Jeannie Jim and this is New Heights Wrestling. On today's episode, we will see the return of Tyler Creed as he takes on the leader of the camouflage entourage, Suicide of Soldia. Tyler has been on the shelf recovering from an injury that he sustained and is looking to get back into the swing of things. Earlier today, J.B. Stevens and our New Heights Wrestling crew were able to catch up with the returning Tyler Creed. Folks, I'm J.B. Stevens, and coming up to me now is a man we haven't seen in so long. I'm excited to see him here back in New Heights Wrestling, none other than Tyler Creed. I know it's great to be back, man. You know what? You know, you got to tell me, what do you want to do now? What do you want to do that you're back? What do I want to do? I want to show everybody. It's been eight months, eight long months. This is what I live, this is what I breathe, this is what I do. Tyler Creed is here to not just make a name for himself, but keep a name for himself and dominate. That's what I'm here to do. Thank you, Tyler. Back to you, Jeannie. just heard, Tyler Creed is fired up, ready to go, and ready for any challenge. However, his next challenge is not going to be an easy one, as Suicida Soldier continues his climb to the top of New Heights Wrestling. Soldier has taken on some of the best and the brightest here at New Heights Wrestling and does not plan to stop anytime soon. JB was able to catch up with Soldier to get his thoughts on tonight's contest. Let's go to that right now. Folks, I'm J.B. Stevens, and coming up to me now is a man climbing the rankings in New Heights Wrestling, none other than Suicidal Soldier. Suicidal Soldier, he is climbing the rankings in New Heights Wrestling. He wants that New Heights Wrestling Heavyweight Championship. Suicidal Soldier, you've got yourself a match tonight. Tell me what you want to do in that match. Well, let me reverse these roles real quick and ask you a question. What do you think I want to do? I want to do exactly what I said I would set out to do, and that's climb the mountain that is New Heights Wrestling and get back into the hunt that I've been on and become heavyweight champion in New Heights Wrestling. But tonight, tonight, I get a rerun in with a good buddy who's looking to make a name for himself too. Tyler Creed, you've been gone for a while, and now you're back tonight, and now you want to see me. Well, here's the thing you need to understand. While you're looking to make a comeback, I'm going to come up and nobody, and I mean nobody, at this stage of where I'm at now, is going to stop me in my quest to become New Heights Heavyweight Champion. Grand Slam Champion! is continuing his climb to the top of New Heights Wrestling and is not going to stop tonight. Soldier has been on a different level lately and is looking to climb even higher. As we mentioned earlier, his opponent, Tyler Creed, is not looking to be anyone's stepping stone. This is going to be an exciting contest as both of these men have been known to pull up all of the stops. Let's not waste any more time and go down to Joe and Dave at ringside. Thank you very much, Jeannie and JB. We are happy to be here at New Heights Wrestling Return of the Storm at the beautiful Vernon Community Center in Vernon, Florida. And I'm the man they call Dave with producer Joe. We are from the Working Fans Podcast, and we will have the privilege of being your commentary team for tonight. Thank you, guys. We are very excited for this match. Because these two last faced each other at Bound and Determined 2021, where the soldier relinquished the tag titles and started his quest for the heavyweight championship. Tyler Creed. Young Hubbard's competitor, Joe. Yes, he's been out of action due to injuries since Double Down Showdown where he competed in the first round of the tag team tournament with Blue Tomcat, got the win, and due to in injury, could not be in the next round. That is where Shane Gibson took his place. And since he's been out, he's hungry to get back in the ring, 
and officials granted him this match with the Suicidal Soldier. Yeah, what a what a match to come back to, though, huh? Like Soldier said, he's on the come up. Yeah. Yeah. Feel that buzz in the air. Here comes the music. Crowd is feeling it. Oh yeah! Look at him. They're oh, all this excited. guy is ready. Everybody, here we go. I have to think, you know. Soldiers in the back is that music. You know, you hear that music. It's like a switch, right? He's getting ready now. He's pumped up back there. Tyler Green's got to make that. He's got to. He's got to be waiting in there. You wonder if the nerves are getting to him. It would be. Look, this young fan is going that close to the curtain to see Soldier as he comes right out. When you have that kind of connection with the audience. You know the whole crowd's gonna be behind him. Now you know, listen to that response. If I were Creed in the ring, no matter how much you prepare, when you hear the crowd going that crazy for the man you're gonna be across the ring for. That has to be on set. Absolutely. Yeah, Joe, this man, I think he's a special athlete. A New Heights wrestler. We're proud to have him. Like, what a competitor. So charismatic. People love him. Since he's been on this quest, the amount of people he has defeated on the way to the heavyweight championship, it's astronomical. Chuck Diamond on Aces High 21. Omkar at Double Down Showdown. Chris Spider at Fury 21. Do I need to go on? No, no, no. This guy's racking up victories over current champions in this promotion. Like, he is on fire. Dave, allow me to go on. We've oh. got Omkar. He defeated Omkar and JT Angel in a three-way match. Both of those happened at What If 2021. He defeated Chris Spider at Bound and Determined 22. He defeated 11 other competitors in the inaugural Bulldog Bash Battle Royal. You know, and the thing is, you, know, you get a victory in the Battle Royal. That tells me this guy, it doesn't matter what side you're coming at for him, he's ready for anything. And in our last event, Aftermath 22, he defeated the former champion, AJ Strokes. His only loss in the last year was a questionable DQ to Chris Spider. So, a loss, I believe, he avenged him. Yes, and I would be nervous being across the ring from this guy, especially the focus on the championship. But Tyler Creed... Like you said, hungry young competitor wanted to get that chance to get back into the ring, and this was the perfect opportunity. Absolutely. And if you want to be the best, you got to beat the best. Tyler Creed, he is ready. He's ready to take on the best. Like you said, Suicide Soldier, he's on that mission. I'm very excited for this match. I really want to see how these guys stack up, you know, with the speed department. Who's going to have the edge? Yeah, because Suicidal Soldier, known for that speed, known for that high flying. Absolutely. You hear the fans starting to rally with them already. You can hear the crowd. This was the perfect match to open this show with. Right. Creed taking a second here. Uh, just a hand. Creed doesn't even hesitate. Shakes his hand. Nice respect. We like seeing that competitive friendship in the ring. Like maybe not friendship, but respect. Like you said, respect. Respect. Yeah. Side headlock takeover. While we get entangled up with words, Creed get entangled up with holds, but returns that leg lock takeover. Yeah. Oh, so shifting that body weight. Known for that innovative offense. Nice deep arm drag. Gets that arm again, cranking on that shoulder. You can see Creed wants to stand up, but can't because of the way that shoulder's holding him down. So we're just letting him to his feet. Yep, he reverses it now. Got that arm wrist lock there. Nice intensity. Goes over, flips Soldier to his back. Now he's putting that pressure on the arm. You definitely see Creed wants this. Oh, look at that. Beautiful drop to hold. Floats over to a front face lock. 
It's hard not to be excited when you see Soldier in the ring like this. Absolutely. And, you know, we talk about his high flying so much, and he's got some great aero offense, but you're seeing right now he can do it on the mat. This guy can brawl. He can do it all. Creed's got him in that hammer lock right now, but he's showing us he can do the chain wrestling. He can do the mat wrestling. Oh, maybe he's sitting up here, perhaps. Oh, yes, the Northern Lights. Getting down one, two. Oh, two and a half. Creed will not be denied. Let's just get a couple himself. I like that it's clear that these two men have scouted each other because you saw Creed putting up a little bit of a re reversal there. Couldn't prevent it. Camping up, but knows what he's in the ring against. People appreciate this as well. You hear the fans. This man's been out of the ring for eight months, but doesn't show. Oh, okay. Much slowing down. Nice reversal on the Irish whip. Misses the lariat. Oh, nice Big slide. leg lariat there from the soldier. Ooh, nice snap suplex. Rolling over for the pin. Getting that body weight across the shoulders, but we talk about it all the time. You want to hook that leg in addition to that. Soldier. Cries of soldier ringing out throughout the arena here. Set up that ropes. When I say arena, I mean the Vernon Community Center in Vernon, Florida. Leg lariat of his own from Creed. Yeah, big slam as well, maybe. Bam, down to the mat. That on. And a nice drop kick. Look at that. Oh, Creed, little bow. Let me try to get his head a little bit. You got to do what you can because I think these two were more evenly matched than Soldier had anticipated. Coming off an injury, you think a guy is going to be a little more hesitant, a little more gentle in the ring. Creed is going full on and keeping up with the Soldier. Back elbows there. Turns around, ooh, right into that corner. Soldier step ahead there. Soldier punishing that middle. Oh, big chop. Oh, you can feel that one. I can feel Creed questioning, wanting to get into the ring again <laughs> after something like that. Oh, oh, another one. You can see the grimace on Creed's face right now. Third. <laughs> Ooh, thought it was going to be a third, but he slapped him upside the face. It's got to be disheartening for Creed, but he gets the Irish whip reversal. Soldier goes nice. over, does a little backflip, catches a boot. Maybe took a little too much time on that flip. Looking for, oh, looking for DT, Soldier, counters. Back into that corner. See, we question Soldier's tactics, but he is right back at it here. You know, didn't miss a step. Good man, dude. I think part of his style is that showmanship, which it'll make you question it watching it as a viewer. Absolutely. But it's he, part of who he is, though. He knows what he's doing in the ring, and that makes me nervous every time. Oh, so this is trying for a big superplex. Pre reverse. Oh, no, drops him. Creed looking for it here. He's up Creed top. going to the top oh, risk. Risk. oh, big frog splash. Oh, he but he didn't pin him. Why is he rolling away? You got to get in for that pin. Yeah, he's feeling the effects of that hold, though. Like the impact of that his old move. Now he's, he's rolling got back. Got that leg. Ooh. You were right, though. If he was been able to stay on him, maybe that leg, he would have probably got him. You know, he put that weight across the shoulders, hooked that leg. But like you said, he was hurting off the frog splash. And That's why it's high risk. That's suicide shoulder. Back up. Back and forth. Look at these nice, nice kick. Another nice kick. Ooh, that, returning that slap to the face. Yeah, putting together some nice offense here. Looks like he was going for a head scissors takeover. Maybe counter into a power bomb. Now Creed with the right hands. Throwing those rights. Oh, back to his feet. Ducks the punch. Oh. Flying all over the ring. Oh, oh my god, maybe like a destroyer DDT. Yeah, DDT destroyer. I have never seen anything like that before. Oh, oh and another big DDT. DDT. <laughs> he has to have closed it out now. One, two, th oh! See, that time he forgot to hook the leg. 
I thought he had it though. Those yeah. that was a combination. That was a great series of offensive. DDT maneuvers. destroyer we've never seen. Then the most powerful DDT I think I've ever seen. But it does not put the soldier away. Soldier, you know what we were talking about? He can brawl. He can chain wrestle. He can fly. He's also got a ton of heart. Fires back with a leg kick. Collecting himself, yeah. kicking the other leg. You want to take away those? You want to take away the height? Get him down to a horizontal position. Then you can get the pin. Yeah, trying to buy himself some time, maybe a little bit too. He's still ringing, I think, from those DDTs. Throws the kick, backflip. Soldier gets out of it. Throws that forearm off the ropes. Irish rip reversal. Oh, big both double lariat. Those like each other. Both guys are hurting right now. And now, like I said, we talked about Soldier's heart. We're going to see Creed's heart. These guys got to dig down deep. The effect of this match, you can see it all over both competitors right now. They, they know they have to get up, but you also want to take that time to get your win back behind you. Creed's turning around. The Soldier's turning around. They're trying to get up. Soldier has that benefit of the crowd on his side. Give you that little bit of, of adrenaline. Both to their feet. Oh, big right. Now Creed's one getting the right hands and an elbow. Ooh, a big shot across the chest. Oh, Another up. one. Yeah, so Creed, he is putting it all together. No, I'm playing around with Soldier a little bit. Got to question that. Big oh, knee. Oh, oh neck breaker. He's putting together these great combination of moves. We look like one, two. two. Oh, that was two and a half. Doing everything right, but still, Soldier kicking out. You know, the longer this match goes, the more and more it looks like Creed is like shaking off any rust he had. He is putting stuff together right now, and it is coming together beautifully. I gotta say the opposite. I think the deeper we go, the more Soldier is benefited by the match because he has more time. He can wear his oh. opponent out. Well, I mean, you know, I'm. You're right with that. Soldier does have the heart. He's been around for a while, but Creed definitely looked like he just any rust. He's, he's shaking it. Ooh, running moonsault. Yep. Sitting across the chest. Two, three. Oh, that was that was like two and three quarters that right there. Super, super close. I thought for sure he had it. And Soldier has once again turned this into his favor too right now. Creed taking that time. Soldier getting that crowd behind him, that's, yeah. I think that's going to prove to be the tipping point. We kind of coming to, yeah. just getting to his feet, big kick, sliced bread number one. Nope, he's going to go for something big, we've seen this before. He's going. He's going to that second rope. What does he got? Oh, he's going to the top. All the way. All the way up. Oh. oh this rolls though. Ooh. <laughs> Creed. Creed was ready for it. Get down for that pin. Oh. oh. Great self-awareness by Suicidal Soldier. No one where he is in that ring. Creed must still be ringing in his head a little bit, not realizing how close he was to the ropes. The last thing you want to do is argue with the ref. You yell at yourself in the back when this is over. Yeah, he's frustrated. Now he's arguing with fans. Oh, this is gonna. This is not the time to be doing this. You want to take it to your opponent who is still on the ground. You can see he's frustrated. He's smashing his own head with a turnbuckle. Even if you're frustrated, stay on your game, though. You can't let the outside noise get to you. Yeah, Creed's going to the top. Looking for something big here. Waiting for Soldier to get up. Big crossbody block. Rolls over. Yeah, Soldier rolls through. Look at the string. Picking him up. <laughs> Drops him down in the opposite corner. What about the power? Oh! Moonsault off the yeah, bottom the rope. rope. Second rope moonsault. Oh, we've seen this before. We know the trifecta's coming. He's done the bottom, he's oh. done the middle. He's going up top. Going up, coming off the top rope. 450 splash. Nice One, two, three. Woo! Another, another big win for Suicidal Soldier.
show. He keeps racking them up. Adding another one to the list here, and it's almost got to make you wonder, will his next match be a championship match? He surely deserves one, but he said he wanted to start at the bottom, go to the top, and I think he wants to face everybody in New Heights Wrestling before he becomes their champion. Doing championship things here, though. Raising your opponent up, showing that respect. Creed came back from injury. He had a good show. And he's raising the hand of the soldier. At the end of the day, they're both athletes. They're both friends. And uh, they both put on a great performance. I don't think I've seen a run, though, like Soldier's had in the past year. And I cannot wait. It's almost inevitable that he's going to be champion, right? It's, a, it's just a question of who's going to be wearing that championship title when he gets it. It's hard to deny him. It's unbelievable. It is an honor to call this guy's matches. Definitely now. If you want to find New Heights Wrestling, hashtag NHW Pro, at NHW Pro on Twitter, New Heights Wrestling on Facebook and YouTube, where you can hear us call... Bound and Determined, Bulldog Dash, and there are so many other great events. Check us out there.